here I am, uncensored, unprepared, and very much from my heart. I hear in the last few years, and especially recently, people gathering around the world with a sense of urgency to contribute to the transition to the new world that we all want to give birth to. I think it's a very meaningful time in human history, this big, huge transition that we are all going through. And many of my friends, my, the people in my tribe, are gathering in many places in the world in order to check if what they do is contributing to the change, to put some awareness and to bring more awareness on the things that they do and see how we could all help more. It's quite exciting. Actually, it's very exciting. The thing which I've been thinking a few days ago, and it just got really strong now in me that I decided just to put the earphones, open my computer, and say a few words. The thing which drew my attention was that I hear mostly and mainly, and especially, big words around this movement. And this movement to create newness, to create a better transition, a better world, is really important, but what if? What if you discover that your role is very simple? What if you discover that your role is actually not to lead big groups of people to the light, but maybe to put one smile on a very old person's face? Or maybe just to hold the baby or a young child and make them feel that this minute can be a better one. What if your role is just to look after one person in your life? What if your role is just to water your garden, your literal garden, and bring more beauty to the world? What if your role is to bake bread for somebody? Or maybe to many, many people, but maybe just to one, one person. What if your role is to make one person laugh? And so on, and so on. I know we have different gifts to give to the world. And by all means, the gift is measured and evaluated and accepted and treasured by its honesty, by its authenticity, and not by its size. I meet many people who tell me, yeah, but what if I discover that my purpose in life is my youth? What if I discover that my purpose in life is not as big as I wanted it to be, or is not as big as other people? is other people's. What if? That's a good question. What if? Are you still willing to do your part, your job, or if nobody is going to grant you with a big, huge purpose or reason for your life, then it's not actually worthwhile even to commit. That's the thought I wanted to share with you. I invite you to reflect. I invite you to write comments. I invite you to open discussion on my Facebook page, Zahara Roten, or in any other store that you find, maybe here on YouTube. I would like to know what if, what if you discover that your purpose is not this, this big thing that people are famous for with so much light and so much love in my heart to all of you 
wherever you are, wherever you are, whatever you do, and whatever more you choose to do or not do.